welcome back guys um, today we'll be trying out something different completely different and completely old school so um, I just found my old um, pack of games and um, I was very surprised to find this gem of a hidden gem of a game uh, from EA games it's called Freedom Fighters uh, it came out I think in the early 2000s if I'm not wrong I don't really remember the exact date of its release but it's really old um, and I I got this game uh, got my hands on this game uh, when it came out and uh, really when I played it it was one of the best games I played till date I mean given the strategy the things that you have to do uh, if you compare if you want to compare it to one of the newer games probably a bit like the division Tom Clancy's the division by Ubisoft um, but this one by EA games and IO interactive this uh, this is really nice you will get to see the gameplay and recently after I found this game I thought like okay why not share it with you guys because uh, this game to be frank to be honest this uh, game you won't be able to you'll not be able to get this game anymore it's completely out of stock and they are not selling it anymore I guess so if you are lucky enough that you still have this game then good good for you give it a try relive the memories as I will uh, here <laughs> but if you don't have it well uh, bad luck but you can try and see if you get uh, an old copy of this game from somewhere in eBay or something I don't know but uh, yeah for those of you who don't have it just sit back and enjoy I guess with that being said I hope everyone is doing well uh, if you really like what you see hit the like button and uh, subscribe to my channel for more games and with that being said let's get started I guess so yeah so we'll be going ahead with single player we'll create a new profile so the difficulty levels demonstrator walk in the park so walk in the park is obviously an easy mode uh, rebel have a blast yeah that makes sense so we are going to go ahead with uh, have a blast because that would probably be like the normal here freedom fighter you got what it takes and revolutionary so this obviously is the hardest toughest difficulty so I would go ahead with rebel have a blast I hope it will not be that tough I, I have no idea name obviously we'll go ahead with Zeus Ace X and we will start the game uh, and if I remember there's a cutscene here so sit back and enjoy anyway when I couldn't pinpoint the exact location of my humble summer cottage in the Hamptons, she dropped me right there. Cold. Damn, I look like an idiot still holding the drinks I've been paying for all night. Well, who cares? You know, her loss. Hey, pop the clutch and let's get on with it. What's up with the work seat today, bro? Hmm, let's see. Isabella Angelina, a condo in Midtown Manhattan, drain plug, and a leaky garbage disposal. Gah. Do we have to get the crappiest route every Monday morning? I wish for once we get a fancy condo on the east side with a view. Whoa. Isabella Angel whatever. She's that hot spokes babe for the warning against Reds movement? Hey, saw her on TV yesterday. Hmm. No idea. Besides, I don't follow all that conspiracy crap like you do. <laughs> what do you mean, conspiracy crap? Doesn't the Soviet invasion of South America bother you? You need a reality check, bro. Know what? Next thing you know, you'll be waking up under a Russian flag, and you won't think it's conspiracy crap then. Mm. Right. You're so in denial. Look, try listening to those warning against Reds guys. What? Speaking of which, how about this rest stop? I 
really like to check out the plumbing on that Isabella chick. Hello? Plumbers on patrol. Anybody home? Yeah. Whew. No wonder. Sister Sludge sure needs a trained surgeon here. There is one here. Breeze! Don't move. Remain calm, citizen. Whoa, hey, stay cool, man. I'm just the plumber. Where is your girlfriend, citizen? Girlfriend? Hey, she's not my... I will ask again, where is Isabella Angelina, hmm? What, her? Look, I think, I mean, she's, look, she's not... Well, Isabella cannot be far from here. Bomb the place to pieces. I want to see a lawyer, buddy. Okay. So, oh, we need to hide, we need to hide. Okay. <laughs> so, um, this is us. Uh, our name is Chris, Christopher's um, Stone, I think. Yeah. Uh, so, um, what this game basically is, like, from the name. So, I'm just hiding in the shower, taking a bath. Wow. Anyway, um, <laughs> so. Um, from the name freedom fighters it obviously makes sense right so the basic basic thing this game is about is like you fight for your freedom for the united states and the russians have like invaded the country and you just free your country that's basically it uh, so you are just a plumber you start off as a plumber and then you just build your way that kind of stuff right so yeah with that being said let's see how it how it goes here oh just some innerware lying around no problem so we just go here wow this surely brings back memories I mean wow anyway so uh, yep so I don't want to say too much, like I don't want to speak too much because I don't want to give out any spoilers, but okay. Left mouse button to attack. What? You're not so it is fortunate that you found me. Quickly, this way. Okay. He won't trouble us anymore. Okay. Got a gun. Hurry! We mustn't linger here. More soldiers. Shoot them. Go there. Sure find us here. We must find another hiding place. Get the guns. See those soldiers down there. We are not as well supplied as the enemy, so we'll have to improvise. Aim at the fuel barrels rather than the soldiers. The fuel barrels. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I remember this. Oh, there, th there's going to be a bomb or something here, right? If I'm not wrong. Oh, yes. We have no time for this. Follow me. I know a safe place where we can rest. Health back. Yep. Use the health pack. You can't afford to let your wounds slow you down. Left mouse button. Good. Yep. You are ready for battle again. We're not out of the woods yet. It's us or them.
Okay. Okay. I, I remember when uh, I I got this game. I had like, you know, a very uh, very old crappy computer. <laughs> I think I had like. Uh, oh yeah. So here in this game we can um, we can heal the wounded like this. E. Yo, that was close. I guess I owe you one. What's our status? Okay, come with me, guys. I've got supplies that'll get us out of this mess. Yep. And if you see on the top left, the green bar is my health, and the other bar, it would be yellow. That tells me how much charisma I have, or how much we like charisma now. level. Charisma level or something like that. Grab a Molotov. Let's show the Reds. And then, um, okay, I grabbed the Molotov, but okay, I have to select it. Throw those babies. And uh, the circular uh, symbols that you have uh, below the uh, two bars to the top left, they actually tell you how many people you can um, you know command uh, under your belt so like later on you can actually command them okay so let's see you just hold and throw them yep I hope everyone is dead no not all of them. Oh yeah, baby! Steve Reich and he's out. Okay. Get any guns? Nothing here. Any guns here? No time to waste. Yep. They'll be back if we don't hurry. Let me just get whatever guns I can from here. Okay. Uh, okay. My guns are ammo is full, I guess. Oh yeah. And in this game, you have these manholes like sewers and stuff, right? So, uh, this uh, in this game, you just Open build your network. Your we can escape to safety below in the sewer. Yep, so we just escape everywhere through these sewers and we build our entire army in the, like, underground in the sewers. Citizens of New York and comrades from the Soviet Armed Forces, welcome to our first news broadcast after today's events. My name is Tatiana Kempinski, and I will be your regular news anchor from now on. We hope in time to obtain the cooperation of most of your familiar TV personalities once they return from a re-education program at our training facilities in Alaska. Meanwhile, I will make sure you get all necessary information about our efforts to restore peace and stability in your troubled country. Our Soviet leaders have been concerned for years by the plight of the poor American people suffering under a corrupt regime. Today, we have finally succeeded in liberating the suppressed masses of Americans from further hardship, and we will soon restore law and order in a new rule of government. And we expect and believe that every citizen will swear allegiance to this new order. Cooperate, and you will reap all the benefits of the Soviet system. All measure of resistance will be futile and dealt with swiftly. Our great leader, Comrade General Tatarin, will be addressing the nation later. So on behalf of the dedicated staff here at the studio and the glorious Soviet armed forces, welcome New York to a better future.
Yep. So this is like underground in the underground sewage, like canals and stuff. This is where we are going to like establish our base, right? Uh, it's kind of cool, like with all the supplies and stuff. Uh, you'll get to see. Wow, this is really nice. Brooklyn. Yeah, so this is currently in Brooklyn where our things start off. We have like all the stuff here. Um, we have maps through which we choose the location where we go and start the missions. This is our base. It's a safe zone. We store equipment here. With complete control of the sewer system, the tunnels enable us to bypass many of the Soviet roadblocks. All of our maps will indicate the location of the sewer access points. Let us go over to the table and take a look at the map. Yeah, so we'll look into the map, but before that, uh, let's just look around once. Uh, nothing here. Here is nothing, it's just a small garden or something. I never understood what that was. And then here we have some like crates and stuff. Okay, so if we go here, that's the map. Yeah, the post office and the police station. So if you click one of them, each of, each one is a mission, right? So police station. Secure the police station and liberate our leader Isabella. Raise your flag to signal her release. The police officers will assist you, but they need your help taking out the snipers on the nearby gas station. Yeah, so police station is where Isabella, she, she is like captured and kept. So, um, police station, we need to go and raid that and free her. But before that, we need to go to post office, if I'm not wrong, to blow up. Post office is a Soviet strong the gas station, yep. It's used as a supply depot to support troops advancing into the city. Your brother is being held somewhere inside. Raise your flag on the roof to signal our victory. To get near the police station, you'll have to destroy a sniper's nest on the gas station. Exactly. So we need to destroy this gas station with like bombs or like I think C4 bombs, yep. And uh, yeah, that's how we have to do this. So. We'll probably go to the police station first. Um, yeah, let's do the police station Secure and see. The police station and liberate our leader, Isabel. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yep, that's how we look now. So yeah, every time we change our base or something, uh, the getup changes. Okay, so let's see. Wow, this really brings back memories for me. <laughs> yep, that's the police fighting the Russians there on the roof. Please help! We're pinned down here! Hey, listen, buddy. Grab some explosives and get back to the sewers. Go to the gas station. That's where you'll need to blow the fuel tank. Just go through the sewer you came from. So, grabbing some explosives. Yep, got that. Yeah, those are the people there. And we just need to go back to the same sewer where we came from. And then head back to, you know, the post office. So Ripple Base, uh, another location. We go to the post office the post this time. Office is a Soviet stronghold. Yep. Yo, man, I gotta talk to you. Check that. You found some C4. All you gotta do now is blow the gas station. Okay. If I'm not wrong, there would be some enemies here. Um, yep, I remember that. 
So I can just use a Molotov or something if I'm not wrong. Uh, but I don't know how far I can... I hope this goes far. That's bad. Okay. Okay, done. Now, take their guns. Awesome. So... Oh yeah, so this is actually the base for our operations, but I will not be... I cannot get in here now. No way, pal. No one gets by until Isabella is free. Yep, so I need to free Isabella first. And only then can I, like, uh, enter this place. So for that... And I think M gives us the map. Yep. So we are currently here. We need to blow up the gas station first. Great. So this is the gas station. And we see there are the people who are shooting... Um, at the police right in the police station so we just need to kill some people here play C4 press E yep now run and see the charisma on the left top would increase yep there you go Charisma plus 25. That's how we get charisma by just completing the levels. Awesome. And now we just go back to the police station. Yep, so another location. Um, police station. Yep. Secure the police station and liberate our leader, Isabella. Okay. So now, when we go back to the same place, we will see that the fight has stopped. Yep, exactly. And we just need to go straight to the police station. Thanks, friend. Nice to get rid of the snipers. Listen, if you're going to infiltrate the police station, I recommend you use the subway tunnel. Exactly. So, yeah, what I thought was right. We just, I need to use the subway. So the subway is here. Yep, and there's a lot of people there. This one I think we cannot use. Yep. So I just need to use this subway tunnel. And he saw me. What a great start. Great. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, awesome. So we got the kills. We need to take some guns. Inventory is full. Okay. So okay, yeah, so that is Isabella. The one whom we wanna we want to free, right? Uh somehow I don't have ammo for the big gun. taken care of who's there no one okay in the police station through the parking garage but stay low or the soldiers will spot you mm-hmm okay the parking garage so that's that side okay Oh, they have like machine guns. Yeah, I remember this. So he cannot see me? Really? Anyway. Okay, so this is the parking garage. Uh, I do not have a lot of bullets, but I mean, yeah, 60 bullets. It's fine, I guess. So here, there's a lot of people, if I'm not wrong. Yep. Just get some guns. I hope they don't see me. There are just some guns lying in the garage. Like, convenient, right? Let me get to this side. So I think I have to go to that... that door there. Let me try go this way. Because I don't remember exactly... like, where I need to go. Anything here? No. Oh. Wrong move. Like, probably he doesn't see me, I hope. Whoa. He saw me. Really? Is he going to come this side? Um, oh, the others are also coming? Did the others hear that? No? Uh, okay. That's good.
This is actually better. This gun is actually nice. Um, this door is also locked, so no point going there. Okay, so now... Okay, awesome. So, time to get that gun. Oh, I cannot jump through there. Awesome. Hmm, so where was that? Here. Great. 69 bullets. Not too shabby. And now we go here. Yep. Okay. Oh, there's a lot of lot of stuff here. Awesome. Can I just... I'm going to kill every one of them. I don't care. Okay. Bad idea. Oh, and yes, I remember that generally in this game if you wait for some time they would come for you. So that is not an issue at all. You don't need to like go after them. Okay, go up. What? This game actually takes some time to play. I mean, if you play it a bit strategically or something, 
Okay, I'm a bit low on health. So, yeah, health. Taken care of. So now we just need to go up. Okay. Wow, that was close. Okay. Things there, so we just go this way. Nothing here. This is the same way down. And then this is the way up. So we just go up. Okay, awesome, got this guy, but I don't remember how to go there, anyway, go this way, oh, we cannot go from here, ah, okay, so we need to go the other way. So you go here. There should be people coming out. I mean, they should have heard. Right? No? Okay, nothing here. There was someone here, I saw just now. Okay, that person. 
person's dead. Please come and rescue me. Okay, so that's Isabella. Over here. Wait, I'm coming. Let me kill them. Over here. Okay, there you go. Before I go there, I need to see if I have anything else. There you go. Yep, yep. So, uh, yeah, that's one more thing that I need to tell you guys. So, in this game, each and every mission is completed when you, like, reach this Soviet flag and you unhoist it, like, you remove this flag and you just hoist your own flag, like the United States flag, right? Hoist flag. So there you go. That's the mission completed for the police station, right? So now we need to do the same for um, post office and the location. So when you finish uh, completing all the missions in one location, you see that the star here turns green. So that's like completed. Now post office. Enter location. Follow me, Chris. I'll take you to the safe house. Okay. So the same guy who was not letting us in now. Isabella, you're back. Yes, and I owe it all to this man. Yes, you do. You must be Chris. Come on in. <laughs> Okay, I don't know how he came to know my name, but okay. I'm not complaining. So you just go inside. This is the base. You see all the freedom fighters this here. This is only a temporary base. We're using it as a staging place for this mission. Let's plan our next move. Like it or not, you have a new profession now. Freedom fighter. Nice work. Thank you. Oh yes, so as uh, what I was saying that time was like um, the top left you can see two circles, right? Those are the number of Come people on, I can recruit. I can recruit and like command under my wing, right? So I think this is when she will allow me to recruit two people. Here we have an overview of the enemy compound. You can see them unloading equipment. They're using this post office as a temporary command center and planning further advances into the city from here. It would really set them back if we recaptured this area. You won't be alone. Ever since you proved yourself by rescuing me, people are starting to believe you. I'll yeah. let you lead two of my best men into action. Exactly. So walk up to each of the Freedom Fighter as it says on the top left and press E to recruit them. Come on. Follow me. Right. Let's roll. Let's move. Yes, sir. Let's get after them. As long as they are recruited, these guys will follow you wherever you go. Just like bodyguards. Now go fight. Good luck. Yes, and the best part is like, best part about best thing about this is like, even if they die, you can just revive them, and uh, you can just revive anyone as long as you just have maximum that many number of people under your wing um, at a given time. So that's it. 
Okay. So we go here. Remember, you are the leader. You can issue your men commands. Order them to attack that small patrol up ahead. Yeah, so pe um yeah, press and hold two. So you can like point them to where you want them to go. Long press two and everyone will go and attack them. Like there. Good. Your men will fight every enemy in the direction you're pointing them. Awesome. So what I would do is I'll just go up here. This is an important vantage point. Gives you an overview of the battlefield, useful for strategic maneuvers. From here you can command your troops and cover them at the same time. Give me a report. Everybody. So I'll just point them there. All of you pinpointing the exact location of your freedom fighters can be very useful for advanced strategy Remember that you can always join the fight to help out your men Where's the other guy? See so this is like he's injured at the moment and I have to just go and heal him I don't know where the other person is at the moment. This will help the pain. Regroup, everybody! Roger. Great, you're a true leader. No, oh, sometimes it's important to know when to fall back. Okay. Um. Uh, help! I'm dead. I got you. Yeah. yeah. So when you heal a wounded. Thank you. I didn't think I was gonna make it. You can just gain more charisma in this way. Stand your ground, all of you. So you can either call them or you can like defend this area. Everybody defending position is order. Defend here, all of you. Awaiting your orders. I'll just slowly push them forward so that. Uh. Yeah, did this make sense? Let me just go this way and command them from here. Mm, yeah, so this place would be a good one. Defend everybody.
Okay, now that person is dead. So that means I can just send them right here. Awesome. Barrels, as usual, in most of the games. They're explosives. These can actually help in, you know, blasting off trucks and stuff. Uh, yeah, so that's the flag, I guess, that I need to. Pull out. Everybody. Roger that. Okay, so let me check where we are. We need to go left. So left, so this side. Let me just check that everything is fine here. Send them there. Yep, nothing here. Everything is clear at this moment. Cool. Get back here, everybody. Yes, sir. I'm falling in. Defend all of you. Remember to check the map once in a while. Just send them Defend there so that they can clear off those enemies. On the map, you can see the mission objectives. It's easy to get lost, so use the map to find your targets. They might make life easier for you. Okay, so now uh, we just need to go ahead and uh, raid the post office from there, exactly from there. Okay, so now that the ground here is clear, 
we just go back and we raid the place. Just put them there. We cannot go this way, so that's the way. Defend this area, all of you. Oh, there's so many med bags. Defend here. Position. Secured. Defend this area. Roger Defend, that. everybody. Yes, sir. I'll hold this position. Stand your ground, all of you. Semper Fi. Fly cover. I'm over here! I'm over here! Help! Wait a second, Chris! man. Defend here! Where are Everybody you? Yeah. That's my brother. <laughs> hey, bro. It's damn good to see you. I knew you'd come looking for me. Okay, and then we just go ahead here. Defend this area. All so, of you holding So position. the main uh like how I play is wherever I need to go, I just send them first. So that the area is clear. Defending position. Mm, is Defend everything clear? All of you. Roger that. On the roof, bro. Don't forget the flag. Okay, so I guess. Trees are gone. Regroup. Everybody, moving out. Stand your ground. All of you, do or die. Defend here. Everybody. Get the flag. Abort, all of you. Roger that. Okay, so that being done, just go ahead and raise the flag. Yes. Yep, that's how it is. And uh, with that, we have completed the post office and the police station missions. We go back to Rebel Base. This is Tatiana Kempinski at SAFN Studios in New York. In today's headlines, a downtown precinct was attacked by rebels earlier today. The attackers freed several rebel detainees. There are reports of many casualties. Several witnesses confirmed that the raid was carried out by a small group of armed rebels, headed by an individual who authorities believe to be the new leader of the resistance. Isabella Angelini, seen in these pictures, is an important member of the underground resistance movement and the operation looked like a carefully planned and executed rescue attempt. The group was led by a shadowy figure as yet unidentified, but believed to be a male Caucasian in his early 30s. Earlier today, I interviewed our leader, General Tatarin, on the situation. This sort of action against the Soviet Liberation Army will not be tolerated, and such attacks only increase tension here. However, I assure you that this was an isolated event and we have restored peace and stability. That was General Tatarin earlier today. On the phone now from Governor's Island is Comrade Colonel Boba, head of KGB. Comrade Kempinski, these people are not rebels from proletariat. This freedom fight.
Quantum is vigilante, a terrorist. So they are few and will be executed when caught. After a trial, of course. And on this reassuring note, let's look at the forecast. What's in store for us on weather front tomorrow, comrade Ilyana? Yep, so every time we finish or complete, you know, the um, missions in one of the maps, we just go ahead and um, transport our base to a new location. And yep, this is the new location with a bit more upgraded uh, gear and weapons and stuff. So let's see where it is now. It was Brooklyn before. Uh, it's still Brooklyn. Uh, but now it's like updated and stuff. So yeah, with that being said, um, I guess that is all. Um, this was the intro to Freedom Fighters. I hope you like the game. This was one of my first games. I won't say my first, very first game, but one of the first games that I played on a computer, computer and uh, I just fell in love with this game. So I just hope that you guys enjoyed it. And if you like it, then do hit the like button and um, comment what more games you want me to play like this. With that being said, if you like what you see, if you like my channel, please consider uh, subscribing to the channel and uh, sharing word about this channel. It really means a lot. I really appreciate the love. Uh, it helps out the channel a lot. And uh, yeah, with that being said, um, with that being said, uh, stay safe, everyone. Uh, I wish you all the very best. Have a nice day, night, afternoon, wherever you are. And uh, yep, I'll see you again in the next video.